going on my friends it's just me once again bring you another place this time I'm at a cemetery um, right across the street from uh, Central State uh, Mental Asylum uh, there's some mental asylum uh, graves over here a bunch of graves old stuff old stones we're gonna check this place out together let's go do that it's a pretty old cemetery I mean, it's really, I mean, 1856 it looks like there. So it's a pretty old cemetery. Been around a long time. Central State, right across the street over there. A lot of old, old headstones in here. It's right off of the main road. So I apologize for any traffic noise. There's an airport close by too, so. These are old ones over here. Very old. A lot of down trees in here I see. I think this is what she was talking about. This is the uh, mental asylum uh, graveyard. Um, I guess there's really no headstones left over here much. There's a couple of them. Um, we'll go check this place out. Now, this is the graveyard for the mental asylum, I guess. Um, like I said, Central State's right across the street over there. Eighteen eighty eight. I'm sure there's several graves in here that aren't marked anymore. Yeah, because there's another headstone down there, looks like. <coughs> Excuse me. The names of the patients and their numbers. Kind of interesting. Three hundred and forty-four people, right here somewhere. It's kind of interesting. It's nice that they built that for them. Remembrance, memory of them. Pretty cool. It's old. I, I just can't get over how old this graveyard is. I'm still teamed up down here with B Town Paranormal. And uh, uh, there's a couple other YouTube channels here. I'll have to go and give it, figure out who they are, give a shout out. I can't remember the names off the top of my head. Um, I think it's like Jason Paranormal or something. Something like that. We'll figure it all out. Let's go. Let's go this way. We already went that way. Let's go this way. We'll work our way back around. 1864. 1851. These are old back here. Look at these. 1865. 1914. It's a mobile home park back here, so you don't want to go back there too far.
just a nice daytime walkthrough video. Before the big hurrah tonight, guys. We're gonna do that abandonment uh, uh, farmhouse, supposedly haunted. We're gonna check that out tonight. So, do an overnight there. Eighteen sixty They're not as old over here, I noticed. Oh, look at this one. This one's kind of cool. I didn't see this one at first. Martha Slusher. 1901. That's kind of neat. Very dilapidated. And obviously someone take care of it, but not too much. <laughs> Some more of these log looking headstones. I love these. I think these are kind of cool. 1904, 1912. Look at over here. An unmarked. I wonder where these headstones went. voices you're hearing are B-Town Paranormal over there doing their stuff. Nineteen oh six. Doesn't seem to be much back here in this corner. Couple, couple headstones. There's all our vehicles lined up together. He's doing uh, K2 readings or something. I'm not sure what he's doing right now. Yeah, he's recording. And yeah, nothing like YouTubers wandering around together in a grave. Oh, this one. Have you been over to the mental asylum side yet? Yeah. You gotta go back, there's a little gate. There's actually a stone wall with all the names and some of the graves. You gotta walk past everything so you're on the other side of the wall, a fence. Oh, all right. That's where all the mental guys are. <laughs> Sarah told me about it. So yeah, I was already there. Figured I'd tell him about it. Yeah, I mean there's a, a lot of graves in here, pretty old ones. 1899, another one. A 
lots of stones in here. Check out this old tree, guys. Old knotted tree. You know this tree has been here a long time. I love old trees. They just kind of give you that spookiness to the graveyard. I think that's just awesome. But there's those fools up there. There they are. Zoom in. This one doesn't even have a date on it anymore. 1907. of down branches here. A lot. Nineteen eighteen. Nineteen oh three. Kind of a cool headstone. Nineteen thirteen, nineteen twenty. Yeah, like I said, this side's a little bit newer than the other side in 1918. Check this one out. I got a car. I got a car and I got room. Okay. I'll ride with roof, right? Um. I got an audience. What the hell? I'm not looking. I am. Ready? Can it be on TV? You gotta get used to people watching you. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> 
1900. The 24th. Yep. And died the 3rd night. Isn't that funny? After he was born. Well, no. no. She died seven years after he died. Or she, yeah, he, she died before he died. She died 1900, he died 1907. Oh, it's creepy as hell. What's weird is this thing right here. It's probably like, 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 for like an urn or something. I don't know. This is the powerhouse, the Central State Mental Asylum. Got a car coming by. Got a team of people here. That is pretty cool. I'm assuming that's who owns the place. Look at this place, man. It's just amazing. That's cool. Must well, have been a way in at one time. Obviously, we can't get into this place anymore. It's pretty locked down. Um, it's kind of sad. I would love to be able to get in here, but it's very dilapidated. Um, yeah, we're not going to take a chance. It's a very cool building, though. I would love to be able to get in here and explore it. But... There's technically a way in. There is a way in, guys, but not during the day. Oh, you ain't kidding, the security camera. Yeah, look at that, guys. They got this place wired up pretty good. Let's see if I can show you this. Where is it? Right here. See that camera? It's watching that area. So even if you did somehow get past the camera. <laughs> I just didn't want to get too close to it. You're good. You know, I don't want to piss anybody off. No.
As long as we don't enter the building. Okay. Yeah, I just wasn't. See that rod iron fence? That's their original fence. They had up in the 1900s. Oh, the rod iron right there? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's cool. See, this is where the old train track Yeah, was okay. There. Yeah, I saw this when I came back here. I just wasn't going to, you know, mess around. You know what I mean? Yeah, see, there's a... There's an entrance in yeah, here. Yeah, I know. I could see it. Well, right there. Yeah. I mean, Look, like there's no hole for it. Yeah, you'd climb over everything and then yeah. have to get over here. And All this is stuff they pulled out of the Well, building. I'm sure. This looks like it's multiple floors, too. Yeah. That goes down and in. Yeah, the basement, the wow. basement part has fallen in. Oh. That's... That's how you used to be able to access it was through the basement, which where it's gated up. Right. Which I'm curious, this thing closed down to 93, but those are brand new air conditioning units. Nah, they're not that new. Hmm. They're fairly, fairly old. All this open land was part of Central State at one time. All these buildings were all part of this. This building is still being used. Obviously, there's a car here. So this building is still being used for something, which is really cool to see. I want to go check out this building right here. It looked empty. So we're just going to go check it out, see if we can look in a couple windows, see what's in there. Just check this place out. So I don't know where those people went. I think they went in that building. I think that building's in use too. So. I mean, just look at this. You can actually see. I just want to show you this real quick. I want to show you the original doors on this place. Look at this place. I mean, it's still got original doors on it. You know, big swing right here. It's kind of cool. I wonder what sat here at one time. Something sat here. Once again, guys, this is Central State Mental Asylum in Indianapolis, Indiana. Eighteen ninety nine, almost like like a neon light. Almost, that's kind of strange. So I just want to see. I mean, obviously, it's still a used building, so I just want to look in. Look at this place. This is pretty cool. Really nice, immaculate. It's a beautiful place. I don't know if you guys can see any more. So I'm not sure what buildings are still being used here, what's not. I mean, some of these buildings are still in really good shape, so I'm sure they still use some of them. Tour upstairs. Just looking. You can see the original stonework in there. I don't know if you can see that real well. A little bad reflection. Let's see if we can get a better view into this room, this building here.
Oh, uh, so this is a workshop is what this is. So they do work to use this place. This place is still used. Looks like an art studios. That's what it looks like. Looks like they're using them for art studios to me. Um, yeah, because I'm sure they are, so. I'm watching you watching me. Oh. Hi. Oh, hi. Yeah, see? Check out the old doors. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, those look original, don't they? Yeah. That's what I thought, too. I even walked up and looked a little bit. I didn't go up in there, but you know, you can see them. Wow. The original doors. That is cool. That's what I thought. Look at the big steel door right here. What is that? Oh, that wow. Was. I didn't even see that just a second ago. Just one now. Awesome. I think they use these places like art studios. Because that's what it seems like. Yeah. Second building down has a bunch of art supplies in it. Oh, wow. That building's empty except for a nice chandelier in the middle. You can look through the windows in that one. Okay. Got a nice chandelier in the middle. Awesome, I've been wandering. Nice. <laughs> I wander a lot. <laughs> cool.